My name is Juliet Ian. I am an assistant lecturer and PhD student at the University of Calabar, Nigeria. I'm also a co-founder and lead consultant at Academic Hive for African Scholars and the executive director of iCapture Center for Development. So I call myself an early career researcher, an academic, an educator, a data analyst, and a social worker. I use OTA for my lectures and trainings on qualitative research methodology and fieldwork, especially when it comes to doing interviews and focus group discussions. I find OTA really helpful when dealing with grad work and policy research, so long as it has to do with meeting people, getting information from them, and analyzing those data that are non-numeric, OTA has really come in helpful or really come in handy. As a research consultant, I get to handle a lot of interviews and qualitative data analysis almost every week. Doing interviews and transcribing them manually can be really stressful and fatiguing. But then, that is the norm here in Africa. OTA helps me collect data, analyze them seamlessly, I just started experimenting interviews on, on Zoom due to the COVID and um, OTA came in pretty handy. I'm able to meet up with data collection and analysis stack so easily that most of my clients ask me how I am able to accomplish so much within a very short time frame. Since OTA, my productivity level has increased. Guess what? In a few days, I'll be facilitating the second edition of the Academic Hive Research Bootcamp and OTA is a major highlight of that bootcamp. So there are certain features I love about OTA, accessible. So this makes it user-friendly and I don't get to deal with a whole lot of licensing issues to even benefit from the product. Again, I'm able to avoid the hassle of playing a recording over and over again just to figure out what was said and who said what during interviews and FGDs. OTA takes care of that and provide more time to concentrate on analyzing and drawing insights from datasets. This is in addition to the user-friendly text and audio importing features. It's OTA, right? It might be the other alternative to some big name, but it's the best option for me. I'm looking forward to exploring more features on OTA Pro.